Hey, how's it going everybody? It's Tanner here and welcome back to a new Ninjago video here on the channel. In today's video, we are going to be discussing the possibility of other ninja future minifigures being released in, well, the future. So this obviously stems from the newly revealed Ninjago future Nia minifigure, which will be coming out next year to coincide with some book. But this does raise the question, will we be getting other various future ninja minifigures as well? So in reality, we only have a few more that we actually need. Of course, Cole did not have a future reflection so I don't really think we need a future minifigure for him and we also really don't need one for Lloyd because he never had a reflection either. So the only two ninja that we still need in their future reflection variants are Kai and Zane. Zane's is going to be easy enough to complete because realistically all you need is the torso and the legs because the head and the hair are going to be the exact same that we had gotten for Zane earlier so there's really no reason to stress about that. But for Kai you would have to make an entirely different minifigure. I feel like future J which is already out was I guess the most difficult task for them to pull off because future J is the most different from current J so naturally they would have to go ahead and kind of overhaul his design a lot which they already did and they already took care of that again you could go ahead and make future versions for Lloyd and Cole but in my opinion that's really not necessary as the only uh, future variants of the ninja that we saw were Kai, Zane, J, and Nia. But that still doesn't answer the question, will we be seeing them in any sort of future, I guess, release? Will these guys ever come out as official minifigures? And I would go ahead and say that, yeah, I feel like they would, especially considering how they just kind of revealed future Nia out of nowhere. I feel like there's a very high chance that we will be getting the other future minifigures later on in later Ninjago waves or even releases. I feel like the big 10th anniversary, though, that's going to be, I guess, the prime time to go ahead and introduce, I guess, every sort of special variant of the ninja, because again, it is the big 10th anniversary and I feel like that's why a whole lot of people want something like a collectible minifigure series for Ninjago for example because that could be a great place to go ahead and release the future versions of Zane and Kai so it all kind of works out there in my opinion I don't really think that there's anything too wrong with that but of course I'm not sure if Lego would go about making a Ninjago collectible minifigure series we already had one for the Ninjago movie and while I feel like they will come back and do something like that eventually I don't think it's going to be for the big 10th anniversary but that would be a very nice place to go ahead and release them otherwise you could just release them like you know just in random minifigure packets or even just in various books just like how the future Nia figure is going to be releasing so I don't really think there's a question of if we will be getting them I think it's more of a question of when we will be getting them again they already got the most difficult one out of the way so in my opinion the other two really shouldn't be that hard to create so let me know down below in the comments what you think about this do you feel like we will be getting these guys soon or will we have to wait a while leave all your thoughts down below and I look forward to reading what you guys come up with. With all that being said, be sure to like, comment, subscribe, do all that fun stuff, and check out the links down below in the description for my other forms of social media. As always, big shout out goes out to my Patreon supporters, including once again the Marvelous Jan. Thank you guys so much for watching this video. Once again, my name is Tanner Fishies, and with that, I bid you for a while.